Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe for all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals. Head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. If I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will, please and thank you. This message is for all of my Geminis. I'm going to go ahead and ground for all of my Geminis. Okay, let's go ahead and start off with the... Okay, Spirit's telling me the Wisdom of Oracle. So we're going to start off with the Wisdom of Oracle to see what I have for you beautiful, wonderful Geminis today. Today, tonight, this afternoon, whenever you may be reaching me. If I can get the cards, y'all. Something just fell on the floor. What is it? Okay. All right, let's go ahead and start off. Fork in the road, come to the edge, a leg up, and then breathe. Okay, so with the fork in the road here, it's like... I don't know why I'm getting monkey see, monkey do, but it's a direction that you need to take. It's a choice that need to be made. You see the different arrows? It's a choice to be made. It's like you have come to the edge and making this choice a lot. <laughs> I keep on getting, um, I'm, I'm getting 21 Savage. Anyway, so then we have a leg up. There's something that, that you want to do, but that you've been guided to do. Do you see spirit right here? Do you see that face? And look at the, all of the white. It's just like new, making way for new cleaning. And then breathe. So you definitely have been grounding yourself. You definitely have been getting it in alignment. And you understand like you need to take better care of yourself and you have been taking better care of yourself. Take a higher resume, okay? Two to see. So there's something that you have gone off by yourself and just did a lot of heavy contemplating on. It's like I'm getting a list of pros and cons, right? I'm and then like I have seven. So you were guided to go ahead and go to your go off by yourself and really ponder on something hard. And we have new life here. Cut the deck right on new life. And then it's a question of why. So there has something that you have been wondering, like why? Why me? Why this? Why that? It's like you've definitely been wondering a lot, like why. And then you you know that like regardless if you have the answer right, why or not, the answer is like right in front of you. It's just there for you to go ahead and pick up. Like you've been guided to go ahead and pick that shit up. It's right in front of you. You may not see that shit, but it's right there, okay? And we have this new life. So it's definitely like um, with you making these this choice, whatever, whenever you're sitting back and just doing the pros and cons list, you, you're definitely understanding that, like, this could have the power to change your life. So this is definitely, like, a, a life-changing decision. And it's, like, something you know is not really for you, okay? There's something that you know that's not really for you, and you know that it's time for you to go ahead and make a move in a certain situation. And, you know, it may take work. There's something that you've been working hard on. There's something that you, you know, will continue to work on. And we have a change in the wind. So there's some type of change. There's some like shedding old skins, like not giving no fucks about what anybody else thinks, like being your true authentic self type energy, okay? And being your true th authentic self is definitely gonna lead you, lead you to this milk and honey, right? It's gonna lead you to be able to have something established. It's gonna lead you to be able to, you know, understand the power of, you know, building on a, a, a steady, solid ground, okay? Then I have the TikTok here, but let's go ahead and see what else we have with tarot high priestess so you have been uh, led to do something you need to follow your intuition in the situation okay um your intuition is not going to lead you wrong um there has been some type of situation that was unhealthy there's some type of um betrayals that you had so you know betrayals that you may have gone through may have tarnished like your your trust queen of swords yeah you definitely have been hurt um, you cover that shit up. You you don't put that shit out there. Um, but you've been hurt. And because you've been hurt, there's some there's some type of like unhealthy way coping me mechanism that you develop. But like I just said, it's exactly that. It's un it's unhealthy. 
Then we have the Hierophant here. So it's definitely like you need to follow your spiritual insight. Um, you need to go ahead and follow what you're led to do. And it's like some type of teacher teaching, some type of learning that you still have to do, okay? And it's like in order for you to get this order, in order for you to have this structure, in order for you to um, understand a lot, you're going to have to follow what you're led to do. Because we like the first thing we have is like you receiving strife at you not getting what you want from not following what, what you're led to do, right? You receiving a lot of lack from not following your intuition. And then we have, um, you know, you have a lot of choices. You have a lot of, um, you, you have a wild imagination, okay? Let's put it like that. You have a wild imagination. And there's like right here, it just stands out to me like there, there's, there's somebody that is not trustworthy, Right. And, and that may be what has tarnished your trust, but it's like somebody that you definitely left, let your guard around, let your guard down. They, they betrayed you. And now we have judgment here. So you're reevaluating your here, your healing. Um, you definitely may have been seeing a lot of signs of synchronicities going through some type of spiritual awakening to help you to understand that following your intuition is never going to lead you wrong. And, you know, just going through a rebirth and a renewal process. So it's like what this new life and the, and then um, the judgment, a second chance. It's definitely like you have a chance to go ahead and get everything you want, everything you deserve, everything you desire. But it's all up to you to follow your intuition, right? Right. You can get led all all day, but you you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make them drink, right? So you know there's some things that you have been learning, and the star. The, I do see a lot of positive changes through healing. A lot of positive changes through healing. And then we have the nine of cups and it's like your wishes are fulfilled. A lot of abundance here. You're definitely counting your blessings and you know, you should be proud of where you have come from, the lessons that you have le learned. And it's definitely like living this um, luxurious, glamorous type of lifestyle that you want and you deserve and you worked hard on being consistent, Knight of Pentacles and being patient, right? There's something that's taken a long ass time. This is a long time coming. Um, but it's like, you really have never given up on it. And you, like, there has to be some type of steady progress. You're, you're really progressing towards something that you have been manifesting. Just continue to stay strong, continue to follow your intuition. Cause you've had a problem with follow whoever this resonates with has had a problem with following their intuition. It's not going to lead you wrong. Following your intuition is going to lead you exactly to where you want to be. Eight of cups. So, yeah, I do see you withdrawing. You're changing your priorities. You're letting go of a lot of things that no longer serve you. And then we have the Ace of Pentacles. Like, that's going to lead to a lot of opportunity. That's going to lead to a lot of, you know, um, legacies being built. Legacies being built and, you know, just some type of monetary blessings. And I do see just, like, a lot of things that you've been wanting. And, you know, get trying to get them the wrong way is just going to automatically come to you because... You're following your intuition in certain situations. And you don't have any time for any petty conflict. You're moving away from that shit. Any petty conflict, anything that no longer serves you, anybody that's like in your energy that you feel like they're they're very like je jealous, envious type energy, you're moving away from that shit. And you're you're moving towards what serves you. And you want like this very you it's like peace is restored. Finally, peace is restored, and you're just definitely just basking in your glory. And hangman with the page of wands, understanding that letting go, like everybody can't come with you, right? Understanding, seeing a new perspective, understanding that there's nothing wrong with growing, understand the way that you may have seen a certain situation is not the way that it has to be, right? Right? Don't, it's just a social construct. It's just something that had, may have been put on you that made you think something a certain way, but it's no, it's not actually like that. It's what you want it to be. You have the power to go ahead and create your own reality. And it's like somebody has been living in this false reality, not knowing that they can create their own abundance. So it's definitely like a lot of risks being taken here. And you following your intuition and listening to the, the messages that you have been given by the divine is definitely going to lead you very far. And getting out of your fears, right? Knowing that fear is only the false evidence appearing real. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as your personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. And I'm just feeling the need to tell you to clear your energy. <laughs> Spirit does that. He stops me right there.
clear your energy. If you don't know how to, I'm sure somebody around you, I'm sure there's a YouTube video you can look up, but just clear your energy. And I have one from the from the past, maybe about a year ago. If I can find it, I'll repost it. There's, um, but you can definitely just clear your energy and and just follow your intuition. There's a lot of goodness around you. And, and just continue to be consistent and you will win. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe for all of your manifestation needs as well as the personals. Head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.